Hello everyone, welcome back to the Action RPG Lessons. In this challenge lesson, you'll be adding a collision check to the bat, along with a string and an integer to control its direction and speed. First, what you'll need to be doing is checking if the bat is colliding with a sword slash. You'll do that inside the bat loop, so you'll check for a collision with the sword slash. If so, destroy the bat. This will be very similar to how we did the player's collision with the bat. Next, in the bat start, we'll want to add a direction variable, much like how we did for the player. Set it equal to right at the beginning. Also, add an integer named speed and set it equal to 2. Add four if statements to the bat's loop. Check each direction. If, for example, the direction is up, move in that direction. This will be very similar to how the player moves, but we're checking the direction string instead of key is pressed. Now instead of increasing the x or y by a specific number like we have been, instead increase the value by the speed variable. Since speed is equal to a number, we can use it like one. Finally, in the game start, add two more bats. You don't need to add any more classes. You could reuse the same one. And just like how you might change their sprite, or x, or y, change their direction and speed to be something different. Try your hand at figuring this out before moving on to the next lesson.